have just these two things that I wanted to share like as a quick haul. Um, one is sticker, planner stickers related, and one is um, some jewelry. Um, uh, two, both are, um, well, I was going to say both are Etsy shops, but actually I think this one is not technically an Etsy shop. So let me, um, let me start with the stickers and then we'll get into the jewelry item. Um, and I've got these turned over because my address is still on the other side. But this one is something that I actually won um, in a giveaway. Um, I'm part of, this is the company Hello Ashley Ann. And let me just check to see if you can see. Maybe I can up there. So this one is from um, the, the store Hello Ashley Ann. And she came up with um, this new sampler pack. And I just happened to win. It was random. Just enter and, and she'll pick um, someone to win. So let me see what's in here. So I'm not really sure, but it doesn't seem like she was making um, stickers. Let me just make sure you can see her card there. Um, sorry about the lighting. I don't have a good setup anymore yet when in my new home. But it doesn't seem like she was making stickers for a while or something. It says shop my Etsy store, helloashleyann.etsy.com. Um, helloashleyann.com. So feel free to check her out. I've enjoyed a lot of her stickers. She has a Facebook group. Um, I can't think of the name of it off the top of my head. But um, I was a part, I'm part of her Facebook group. And she had posted this new kit on there. And I won. So let me refocus here. Okay. So this one is her Bright Stars. And she sent me as part of the, the prize the whole entire kit. Um, these are some extras that I ordered. I'll show you those too. But she sent me the whole entire kit. And you can buy these in pieces. Or you can try to buy the whole entire kit. Whatever um, you're interested in. So... Let's just start with the big sheets and then we'll go through the small sheets. So here you have, you know, headers, um, like things you might could use on your sidebar, some habit trackers, a weekend banner, and it's just like this beautiful starry um, look to it. So there's the full boxes and it says the darkest nights produce the brightest stars. So I like that. And these are like matte stickers. Um, this one says the darkest nights produce the brightest stars, so that's cool, like some washi strips, um, some labels, half boxes, quarter boxes. And here are your um, ombre heart checklists, pretty. And this is a washi page, so you've got your bottom washi here and then some washi strips that you can use to fill in. And here you've got your um, icons, you know, labels for various things, and half boxes. Half boxes are my favorite to use. So there's that. And then you have these, you know, samplers to go along with it. So additions that you can add. So date night, payday, cleaning day, plan, lazy day, and then a couple more repeats there. Work, laundry, payday, day off. Me time, very cute, and icons, so that's really great, um, super cute, and hydrate, and I actually, it's funny because that's what I ordered more of because I need to focus on, on hydrating, like that's <laughs> something I seriously need to focus on, so this one comes with, so enough for two weeks, that's 14. And, oh, sorry, these are the ones I ordered extra. Hang on, let me just double check here. I thought, I couldn't remember how many I ordered extra. Okay, so, so that was the freebie. That's what I won as a prize, um, her Bright Stars collection. So that's just really beautiful. I'm really excited to use it, and hopefully, if I get the chance, maybe I can do a plan with me that includes me using this. Um, I'm not sure when yet, but I will probably use it soon because I don't really have any other kits to use. So, <laughs> so there's that. Okay. And then I'm trying to remember because I, I know I ordered all these habit trackers, um, hydrate stickers. Hopefully you can see all these. 
Um, and they all come with this extra little believe in yourself, do it, I can, I will. So that's really cute. And I just, I need to focus on this. So I got some green and red that I thought I could use at Christmas time. And then I just picked basically like one of each of the colors she was offering. I thought these were good fall colors. And then these will be good, you know, in the winter time or springtime too. Um, the blues and the pinks. And so this one, I can't remember if I ordered it or if she tossed these in. Um, I'd have to go back and look. I might have ordered them because I was thinking about using something like this to indicate when my son goes to preschool and again more hydrate stickers so I can't remember but these are just really cute I have to say I'm very excited and pleased and it looks like they're pretty good quality so I'm very excited to use them and this one I thought was cute um, just little trash cans um, for trash day so I'm trying to get more um, functional with my planning and just it's difficult for me to do a full no white space um, planning I feel overwhelmed by it so I, I'm trying to stick with more functional things so I picked things that I knew I would use like I always want to indicate that it's trash day my son always is going to preschool and I definitely need to hydrate so that's what made me choose these when I was purchasing purchasing these extra ones so that's just a little bit of where my head is at. And I hear my baby crying, so let me hurry up and finish this. So the second thing I wanted to share are these um, stamped jewelry pieces from Lazy Sunday on Etsy. And the cool thing I think about this, too, is that I met this girl through my planning um, little addiction that I have now my planning hobby and she's also from North Carolina and I'm from North Carolina so I really enjoy um, supporting her and her company um, so I wanted to take the opportunity to share and let me see if I can focus in hopefully you can see that Lauren Bottoms and it's um, lazysundayjewelry.etsy.com and she also has Facebook and Instagram <clears throat> the listing that I chose comes with like well, you tell how many kids, how many children you want, and it's really just the stamped um, piece and the birthstone. So this one is for my son Austin. It's a little boy, um, and so it has his name Austin, and then his birthstone is November, and then this one is Ian. Hope you can see that, and his birthday is is um, July. So those are. That's what she creates, but then I had I saw or noticed that some of her other pieces included little charms, and I asked her. So she kind of did this for me custom. I asked her if there was if there were charms I could include because I actually wanted to take these three pieces and take them off the necklace. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I wanted to take these three pieces and take them off the necklace and I want to create like a bookmark to put in my traveler's notebook journal that I keep for my boys. Um, and so my son does not have a dirt bike. I just want to clarify this. He's three, but he loves anything that has wheels. And, and when we go visit his older cousin who has a dirt bike, they'll take him for little, you know, slow rides on the dirt bike. Um, so he's just in love with that kind of thing. And so when I was looking through all the options for various, um, I was trying to find something that, that made sense for my boys. That one just kept coming back to me. And I thought, you know what, I'm just going to go with it. Even though he doesn't have a dirt bike, it's, it's what I think about right now for him. So he loves them. So I got that one for my son. And then this one is just a little teddy bear. So my, my Austin is, is only one. So he doesn't really have like, you know, something that he's into, cars, trains, whatever. So I just thought a teddy bear was perfect for my little baby boy. Um, and that's what he is to me. So anyway, um, I, I would love this. I think it turned out great. I'm so pleased um, that she was able to do this little extra for me and give me these extra charms. And I didn't pay attention or asked her about it, but I had hoped that I could slide these off the chain. But it doesn't actually look like I'm going to be able to because they're not the way that the chain is made. They're actually, you know, on there. They're not big enough to slip over that hook. 
but you know I can take them apart I can I can pull apart this piece you know so I was gonna have her send them to me without the chain you know just send me the individual charms but it wasn't that much you know cheaper you know so I thought well you know what just go ahead and send me the whole thing and I'll I'll deal with it and I might use that chain for something else so we'll see what we can do I can probably actually now that I look closer it's almost like a key ring so I can probably slide this out and then I'll be able to, yeah, then I'll be able to take off the, the charms. So anyway, I hope you can see that. Um, and if you're interested, of course, I'll link below um, her, her shop. But they're just really super cute. And she has lots of options um, for, for stamping and, you know, even others with charms and that sort of thing. So it's a great gift idea if you're, sorry, I keep pulling it away from the camera. It's a great great gift idea if you're looking for something new um, or something a little bit different for Christmas. So thanks for watching. Take care.